In Europe, we currently have more than 200 gene cell and tissue based therapy developers. And those are spread across 20 different countries. So there's a lot of interest in Europe. There are five approved gene therapies and six approved cell therapies on the market in Europe. And we are on the cusp of an even bigger breakthrough. So we're expecting in 2021, five more gene and cell therapies to be considered for approval by EMA. And these range from a gene therapy that can treat AADC deficiency, which is a serious neurological disorder, to Idacel, which is a CAR T therapy for multiple myeloma, which is a serious and often fatal blood cancer. So with EMA expecting to approve between 10 and 20 new gene and cell therapies each and every year by the time we hit 2025, so just a mere four years away, we're dealing with a very fast moving science here. And that's why we have got to get these policies, regulation and reimbursement right. And we've got to do it right now.